What if I told you performing your chest flies on a flat bench is better than an incline? Taking a look at the activation of both our upper and middle chest, you can see that the flat dumbbell fly definitely results in more activation of the middle chest, however you can also see that the upper chest gets heavily involved as well. After raising the bench up to a 30 degree incline, we see something that honestly surprised me. Upper chest activation actually stays completely equal to that of the flat bench fly. The only difference you'll notice is that the middle chest is now activated quite a bit less, however it still seems to activate as much as the upper chest. Does this mean the incline fly is worse than the flat bench fly? Well first of all, a cable fly is always a better option than either of these. However, if you do want to do dumbbell fly still, it would be safe to say that the flat bench variant is a better option, especially since the incline version doesn't seem to target the upper chest anymore than the zero degree alternative. 